What's up Xiaomi fans, Christian here. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, I'm gonna talk about this Weha electric screwdriver, which is a predecessor. This is like an upgrade from what I have before. I have the uh, Weha high precision screwdriver. This, I have been using this for like almost five years now and the quality is, is it has a great quality. It has a good case. I never lose anything. Everything is still intact inside the case, which I'll be showing you later. We're gonna have some comparison. And I love it because it's quite handy. It is uh, it is very useful. And now this is an electric version of what I have. So it's kind of like an upgrade. Okay, so let's start with opening the box. Let's see what we have here. All right. Okay, first thing I have is the uh, charging cable. This is a type C charging cable uh, so that you can charge the screwdriver, the electric screwdriver itself. Okay, let's see what else we have. Okay, all right, so it's wrapped in plastic. We have the uh, screwdriver set. Uh, yeah, look at that, so. All right, so the build quality is really, really nice. As you can see, uh, really amazing. It's pretty neat. It doesn't seem to can easily be scratched. It's an aluminum uh, alloy material, and you just have to press to pop out the uh, case. Ooh, look at that. You can look closely, see how the quality is. It looks really good, as you can see. All right, so we have uh, 20 screw types with the head of the uh, screw and we have the electric uh, screwdriver up in here okay well it doesn't seem to be heavy it is pretty light and the screw head actually uh, is is actually secured in a magnet so you won't drop it easily so look at that oh by the way i got this from heka so make sure you check the link in the description below if you want to purchase this I'm gonna talk about uh, the screw heads in a while. All right, let's have a look at this electric screwdriver itself. It is aluminum alloy, and as you can see, there is a, a left and right rotation that you can control. And also at the top there is like that switch, so you can actually just uh, set it to off, which is in the middle. There's also a one, I think that is the um, the rotation speed and there is two which is probably faster than than the um, one obviously it's ultra quiet it's quite quiet and at the other side there is that um, type c port which you can actually charge the battery okay so let's have a look let me try the okay Whoa, look at that. So there is also a magnet to secure the screw head on the electric screwdriver itself. So that is pretty amazing. It's fairly easy to use actually. How about the specs for this Mija electric screwdriver? The material again is actually aluminum alloy. The color, it only comes with one color which is gray. Product size is 201.8 by 74.2 by 25.2 millimeter. Product weight is 353 grams. The screwdriver net weight is 59 grams. So that is pretty light actually for the screwdriver. I'm talking about the rotation speed of the one and two. One gear max torque is 0 0.0 Newton meter. And then two gear max torque is 0 0.2 Newton meter. And the manual maximum torque is three Newton meter. So you could actually use this without uh, switching on the motor you can still use it as if you're using a non-electric screwdriver so that is uh, that comes pretty handy it can still withstand three newton meter uh, torque rotation and the maximum revolution is 200 revolutions per minute the battery size is 350 milliamp hour and maximum that you can charge this actually i would consider it as a slow charge because you can you have to charge it up to 200 minutes all right let me talk about the 24 pieces of s2 high strength material so there are like six pieces 45 millimeter long bits and 18 pieces of precision bits hardness up to 60 hrc each of it is actually labeled and there's also some 
like uh, drawings on top of it so that you don't have to lift it and see what it looks like because you can already see it from the top. Now let's talk about the features of this electric screwdriver. One of the features, it is small size, it has built-in rechargeable lithium battery, it has a long battery life, up to 400 plus screws that you can lose or tighten when it's fully charged. There's also a TPU soft rubber material with soft touch is adopted which can be pressed and used for a long time without tiring your hands. A low center of gravity enhances handling, a non-slip texture for better grip. Being electric is actually quite a plus factor and the size, the weight, and I mean it's not, it is quite handy for you to use. All right, let me compare it with the non, uh, non-electric version, which I have for like years. Look at the size of this two. So the, it's a quite big difference in the size. And yep, so the build quality is the same. I probably have scratch. Oh, I haven't scratched it. There's no scratch at all for this. I've been using this for quite some time. All right, so let's see what we have uh, here. Okay, looking at the screws, they look identical. Uh, let me see if I can probably switch the screws. Yep, so they have the same size and uh, you can use it either uh, if you use the non-electric version. Look at the size of that non-electric ver electric and the non-electric version. The non-electric version has this rotating um, base probably because that is when you uh, twist and turn. It'll be more uh, more convenient for you to uh, use the screwdriver, and uh, yep, so that is pretty good. Fits well for the screwdriver case. Okay, so I, I would say that having both actually is pretty amazing. I have been using the non-electric version. I still have it in a mint condition, and now the electric version makes even things much more easier. If I'm probably changing some, um, I, I used this before when I upgraded the RAM of my old uh, Mac computer and also changing some batteries of my um, son's toys. And yeah, th this has been very handy. Uh, but sometimes the only drawback for this is that sometimes it is too small. So you don't have the grip if it's, if, if it is really, really tight for the screw. And for this, as I've tested, since it's big, you have the grip. Um, if if you cannot use the electric version, you can actually have still have a maximum torque that you can actually use this as a manual screwdriver. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. And as always, you can check out the links and there will probably be discounts. I'll be putting them on the description. And this has been Christian from All About Me. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.